Hi, TJ. Thank you for taking the time to speak with us today. To start off, would you like to introduce yourself? So I'm TJ O'Neilly. I'm the Vice President of Construction Materials, uh, and I'm in charge with the daily management of our ready mix concrete business and our quarry business. Can you please give the audience an overview about ONG Industries? Sure. ONG Industries is a diversified construction services and construction materials business located in Connecticut. We pretty much do uh, almost all of our business within the state of Connecticut. We do uh, construction management, general contracting, heavy highway construction, bridge building. So ONG operates uh, um, eight ready mix plants out of six locations. And uh, we have nine asphalt plants and four quarries. I've learned that the relationship between ONG and Cystine started over a decade ago with badge controls. That's correct. Uh, we installed our first system in Beacon Falls, Connecticut uh, in 2010. Why did you choose Cystine as a batch control provider back then? Well, there was a lot of industry consolidation going on. Uh, we had been a, a control solutions and an auto control customer for a long time. Um, those uh, businesses were bought up by a larger uh, organization. At the time, uh, I was looking for an alternative, and uh, Cystine being a company from Connecticut and us uh, having our operations pretty much 100% in Connecticut, it seemed like a good idea to give you guys a try. Did you have any concerns about using Cystine? No, actually, uh, I've heard some good things about uh, the system. Um, and uh, we uh, implemented it in, in the, that one plant at the time and uh, right away got good feedback from the batch man on, on its reliability and its ease of operation. What inspires you to continue using Cystine? Cystine's been good to work with, you know, over the last 10 plus years. Uh, one by one after that first uh, transition, we've been, you know, as, as the plants have needed upgrade, we've been switching each one over to Cystine with the drive to have sort of a standardization and uniformity in our business, primarily for, uh, you know, our, you know, our own operational ability and flexibility to be able to move uh, personnel from plant to plant and have them know how to operate the system. And, uh, you know, I just, we really wanted continuity. ONG is the pioneer for embracing cloud batch. Why did you decide to make such a decisive move to the new generation of concrete batch control? Primarily to have access to the data at the batch plants remotely and to have a window into how the batch plants themselves are operating remotely without having to actually be on site. This is a business that, like any other business, you have to innovate uh, and you have to innovate in order to stay, you know, ahead of your competitors and also to uh, just um, be on the cutting edge of where the industry is in terms of technology. Uh, and it comes back to uh, being able to, again, have access to the uh, data that's on the batch computer in terms of quantities that are batched daily and also how the batch system is uh, running. Is it running optimally? Is it, is it running as efficiently as possible? And to be able to uh, access that remotely is a great time savings, not only for our uh, accounting department, but our quality control department, as well as our operational people. What do you think ONG would be like if you weren't in the cloud? Well, it'd be like it was about a year ago, <laughs> which, you know, um, yeah, you just, you, you're running your business. I don't want to say you're running it blind, but uh, it's, it's certainly a great advantage to have access to the information that's on the batch computer real time for a variety of purposes. And that includes the, the quality control uh, department, which is extremely uh, you know important to this industry. Making sure you're getting your concrete right, making sure you're not over batching or under batching certain products, making sure you can adjust your mix designs appropriately, and the ability to sort of uh, manage that remotely is key, as well as uh, to access you know all the uh, quantities uh, that we're batching. At the end of the day, we can run reports and see how many tons of cement and stone were consumed at each plant and we can bring that information back to our back office and uh, use it for our various accounting functions. With the ability to review what just happened, have you found any serious mistakes? 
No, we haven't found serious mistakes, but uh, you know, actually, it's 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 better to be able to uh, monitor and see that things are going good, and and know that uh, to have that peace of mind as opposed to be wondering or to find out a problem when it's going to cost you more money to fix it. Got it. On a separate note, can you share your experience migrating your old dispatch system to Concrete Go? Sure. Yeah, we um, implemented uh, the new system back in about, I think, January of 2021, and we went live in April of 2021. So it took about three plus or minus months to uh, get everything switched over and up and running. But we were able to uh, install the new software uh, on the computers in our ditch dispatch office, train our personnel uh, how to use the system, and uh, integrate it with our uh, J.D. Edwards ERP in that time frame. Systime service team is uh, very helpful. They're available when uh, you need them and uh, provide uh, pretty uh, quick solutions to the uh, problems. Can you share your decision-making process to adopt Systime's entire product suite, including dispatch, GPS, e-ticketing, and cloud batch? You know, Jill was trying to, you know, get me on the dispatch uh, software, Concrete Go. And I kept saying, well, you know, Jill, I've, I've got somebody that's selling me dispatch software and I have somebody else that's selling me truck tracking and I have somebody else that's selling me e-ticketing and I have somebody else that's selling me uh, a quality control package. And I'm really just waiting for one company to do all those things. So I'm really only doing business with one company. Once I saw Istrata come on, uh, which is the truck tracking customer portal, uh, you can do payroll with Istrata. Once I saw that come online and uh, I saw Concrete Go out there and I spoke to some other people that were using Concrete Go and, and you know were happy with it and getting good results, then that's when I made the decision to integrate everything. And I think, you know, to uh, continue to build on that, you know, to weave in the quality control packages, to weave in the sensors on the trucks that will auto status the trucks and, and actually automatically track the water added to the loads. So just to continue to build out the whole system so that uh, as a ready mix producer, you only are talking to one vendor who's providing all these services, and then they all work together. Uh, what I really didn't want to have was uh, a batch system that's made by one company and a dispatch system that's made by another, and they can't talk to each other, or they can talk to each other only if you sign a interoperability agreement and you pay both parties to get them to talk to each other. I didn't want that. I wanted our dispatch to automatically be able to send tickets to the back batch computers to cut back on errors. I wanted our quality control people to be able to go in to change mixes and have them be the same mixes that are not only in the dispatch office, but are also the mixes at the plant. And, and I really wanted one thing all together. Um, and Cystine moved in that direction. And when I felt they were far enough along, that's when I decided to go to Concrete Go, to go to iStrata, and then ultimately to go to the cloud so that we can then access all that data that's out there, analyze it, and be able to use it to our benefit. What do you like most about using Cystine? My favorite attribute probably is uh, that it's intuitiveness, it's, uh, it's uh, uh, ease of operation, and it's reliability. I think that uh, you know the people that use the system daily uh, really uh, enjoy operating the system. They find it easy to work with. Uh, they find that it flows well, whether that's order entry or, you know, assigning tickets to loads, the, the, the whole dispatch operation. And then our, our quality control people really uh, enjoy uh, being able to access uh, the uh, batch systems remotely, make adjustments as needed. And it's just everything is right there and very easy to use. How has Cystine impacted your success? 
I, I think primarily uh, the reliability of the system. I mean, you know, when it comes to being successful in the, this business, it's all about reliability and quality. And so if you are uh, able to provide your service on time to your customers at the proper rate of delivery throughout the day, day in, day out, that that is what our customers ultimately want and uh, ultimately what they choose doing business with a ready mix company for. And so Cystine is, uh, is a great help in achieving those goals. How do you measure the value that Cystine provides? I think just repeat business. The fact that uh, we're able to uh, retain customers uh, and compete uh, based on our service and our quality rather than simply on price. Do you have any advice for Cystine moving forward? I'd just say, like everything else, just continue to improve on your product, continue to innovate, continue to offer uh, solutions that you know, our industry needs. It was great speaking with you, TJ. Thanks again for taking the time to speak with us today.